Last time I showed you how I decorated my dining area. Now I want to show you how I made some of the decorative accents that really elevated the style of the room. I'm going to show you how I made these decorative pillows and also how we made chair covers for my dining room chairs. We used fabric remnants that we found at the thrift store and we created some decorative pieces that add warmth and elegance to the room. To make this pillow, I used remnant fabric and I cut it to my desired size. And this is a piece I found from the thrift store. I also found this piece of quilted gold metallic fabric that I'm gonna to use to make an applique. I drew a freehand sketch of a crown and I created a template so I can make an applique. I'm going to zigzag stitch around the entire edge of the applique before I cut it out and apply it to the other piece of fabric. Now the crown is cut out. This is so cute. I can't wait to put it on the fabric. So now we're going to measure the fabric to prepare it for the applique. Now I'm measuring and marking the fabric so that I can make sure the applique will be centered on the pillow. Now that I have my markings, I am going to first apply some glue to the applique to make sure it is stable and centered before I actually sew it on. I'm applying fabric tack glue. I am going to let the glue sit and dry and then I will sew the applique on to make sure that it is stable and that it will stay on the pillow. Now that the applique is on, I am going to sew the pillow and stuff it. Now you can do this several ways. You can make a case for pre-made pillow or you can add a zipper so that you can zip up after you stuff or you could just stuff it and sew it up by hand. I just love how these pillows break up the floral pattern and create an extra added accent to the room. When I look at these pillows, I can't believe they were just thrifted, discarded pieces of fabric that nobody wanted and here we created a whole new item. These are my dining room chairs. They are normally white, but I wanted to add some more color for the holiday season. I found some floral pattern fabric at the thrift store and I'm gonna use that to make a chair cover for my chair. This is a beautiful floral fabric remnant that I found at the thrift store and I only had enough to cover the back of the chair. So that's the main part you see. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I measured and I had exactly enough to cover six backs on my chair. So I measured about 18 inches across and cut out the back covers for each of my chairs. And these are just chair covers. So they actually just cover your existing chair. There's no reupholstering. It's just a removable cover that I can take off and put back on at any time I wish. So I have my strips cut out and I am going to start checking the fit on my chairs before I sew them up. So I place this on and like I said, I'm just covering the top uh, back part of the chair. I'm going to leave the seats white because I do not have enough to make chair covers for the entire chair. So just the back. After I determine the proper fit, then I'm going to head to my sewing machine so I can sew down the sides of each chair cover. I'm also going to add Velcro to the edges so that I can create a fastener to fasten the chair covers onto the chairs. So this is how it looks once I've sewn down the sides of each chair cover and I added Velcro so that I can affix the chair cover properly and neatly to the chair back. Let's put it on and see how it looks. These chair covers really elevated my dining room, made it look really elegant and festive. I think it came out so beautifully. Thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe and I will see you again in the next one. Bye.